After some fascinating world championships, the biathlon world traveled to Asia in Pyeongchang, Korea. One year before the Olympics, this World Cup is a good opportunity for all the teams to take their bearings and discover a new stadium for 2018. It's really important. I think it's uh, uh, not a competition by themselves is so important, but that you see the tracks, how the tracks are created, and so on. I think the uh, also the weather, the shooting range, it's a really important competition. This week, sprint pursuit and relay are scheduled. And in the main, the absence of the buzz, Svensen and Champ leave the way open to Martin Foucault to already win his sixth big crystal globe. Only Anton Chipun can stop him. It will also be a good occasion to see how the 2017 new World Championship have recovered. Especially Benedict Dole, the sprint's gold medalist. Uh, I really like the track because there are some um, really um, stiff um, uphills inside, so I really like them. It's a little bit difficult because of the times. Um, over the day it gets really um, a weak and deep the track and then when we will start the race it will freeze already so maybe uh, there will be not so perfect conditions. In the women, once again, everything will be about Laura Dalmayo's shape. After her six World Championships medals, the German girl tried to rest, but can't say if she will be at the same level as Anna Filsen. Uh, we will see. Um, I'm a little bit tired after the journey, but I think uh, until the first races, um, it will be okay. For the other girls, the important will be to keep focused and try to get used to these new conditions if they want to stop the big crystal globe conquest of Laura. Night competitions will be on the program all week long and it starts on Thursday with the women's sprint. <laughs> <laughs>